back out again. <laughs> so, out for a wee stroll tonight, a bit of cooking. I'm going to get the, just the wee basic steel fire stove, total basic one. Just going to set that up, it's just basically like four plates, clip together, and then I'm going to make fluffy American pancakes. Mmm. A couple of strawberries, a couple of raspberries, some blackberries, and a wee bit of Canadian maple syrup. Sounds good to me. You know it does. So, just going to have a wee wander. We like exploring again. As you do. So, I'm going to find a nice wee bit to sit. And this looks like it right here. Eh. Hey. And I'm going to cook these pancakes up. So first things first, I'm going to get the stale fire stove, build the wood and get it going. So we'll just clip it together first. So, this is just the very very basic, this stale fire stove that I've got. It clips into about 12 dozen different configurations. So I had the bush runner out the last time, which is obviously, it's almost like the Dakota fire pit. But this is just a total basic setup. Just looks like a bush box kind of thing. But as you can see, this one's a stealth fire. And it literally is, it's just plates that basically clip together. Good bit of kit. Handy wee bit of kit and the fact that you can make a couple of different configurations with it. Got my trusty Petromax pan, uh, and I've already I've made the I've made the fluffy fluffy American pancake mix, so I've made that up earlier on. So I really just need to get this going and start cooking. That's the handy thing about these. Kind of, I don't know what you would call them, twig stoves. I chuck everything on it for pine cones to. The twigs to basically anything that's going to basically burn. You probably hear that thunder, so I think it's going to pour the rain shortly. But we'll worry about that when it happens. Right now, I'm more interested in getting the pancakes in the go. So we've got all the, the mix made up, so that's fluffy American pancake mix, deluxe pure Canadian maple syrup, and then I've chopped up, like I say, strawberries, blackberries, and raspberries, and then we're basically just going to stick that on the top and get cooking. So, that's that, that's going good now. We'll stick this on the top. And then what we're going to do, we're going to stick a couple of, maybe you can have a little bit of butter in the middle, melt that off. And So, fluffy American pancakes. So, it lets one side of that cook and then we'll turn that over and do the other side. I think these will taste pretty good. Huh? What do you think? Perfect. All good to be. One side done. It's flipped over. Now we'll do the other side. Right, off the American pancakes. A wee bit of Canadian maple syrup. Oh yeah. 
right, rain's coming down. But, as I always say, I'm a bit of rain in it. So, time for the taste test. Off the American pancakes. Mmm. Why? Oh, top banana. Absolutely brilliant. So I reckon I've got enough. I don't know, a three or four of these. What I'm going to do is, I'm just basically going to work my way through them and eat them all. Oh, it's light. It's got to be done. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Right, that's one done in. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Time for number two. Well, I was going to have another three or four, but what I've decided to do is, because I'm greedy that way, I've just chucked a whole lot in. So I'm just going to have one mass, massive, big American fluffy pancake and chuck the whole lot onto that. You. But I think this one, well, this one's going to be good. I just hope I can fit this on my plate. If the pan's big enough, but the plate I've got, well or not that, it's going to fit on this, I don't know, but we'll soon find out. But, number two, here we go. So, I'm just going to let that second one cook. Like I say, just get a wee stealth fire stove out with me tonight. Eh, uh, come the weekend, but I'll uh, be back out camping. I've got the TP tent up, and I'm going to try that new Criterium stove I've got. Out of our choices with stoves, all got their different uses. Uh, tonight, obviously, just out in the woods, so I've just took a wee. The steel fire stove is pretty good for that because it's, it's small, it basically packs down into three or four plates. Clip it together, job done. But it's ideal, and obviously, don't need any gas because it's just a plug stove, so you just cut plugs and plugs and uh, pine cones and whatever else you want in, fit and done. Refuel. I can't tell why these American fluffy pancakes are the business. Huh? Fantastic. So, who else has been out? Anybody else been out lately? I'm quite sure there's folks starting to go out for out for the day, out for a wee barbecue. Probably seen my last video was out in a kayak. That was great. Was great to get out in that again. Absolutely fantastic. Oh, it was a perfect night. Absolutely perfect. Sun was shining all night, all day. Water was perfectly calm. Whereas tonight, just out in the woods. Out in the woods in the pouring rain. But hey ho, only a bit of rain. And your skin's waterproof, isn't it? Right, that was good to go and all. Time to eat. Right. That was definitely too big for the wee, the wee plate I've got, so I'm just going to eat it in the pan. <laughs> oh, aye. Looking good. Right, time to dig in. Right, folks, number two. I think you can see that. Oh, aye. Fantastic. So.
Hei, pancake number two. Fine. So, no brew with me tonight. I'm just got a, a can of Sprite. No wine. Nothing like that. During the week. Staying good. So, I'm gonna... I don't know where I'm gonna go this weekend. I might go to... Uh, I think I'll probably go to a different walk. Might even take the kayak with me again. I must have not enjoyed going out in that. I've just, I've just did to. Well, it depends weather. Weather dependent. But I did hear somebody saying the weather's supposed to be good at the weekend again, so. The weather's going to be good. I'm quite sure the kayak will be coming as well. Whether I take the fishing rods, don't know. Well, it depends what walk I go to. But I do quite fancy. Uh, well, I'll not say, I'll not say where I'm going. Right, whether or not it'll be solo, or I'll be going with somebody, I don't know. I've not done a solo in a wee while. So, I quite like, like a group camp, I like a solo camp as well. Plus, there's a few folk. I can't tell if a few folk want to look campless. A uh, few different folk, so just trying to kind of juggle that and put all them in as well. But I'm sure they'll manage. You know me, I can't kind of stay in. But it's, as you can see, the, the rain's coming down. I've not even got a tarp or anything with me. Ah, uh, usual, unprepared. But, I'm not that far from home, so. And the fact of that's me, I've had my dinner. Well, I'm saying dinner. I've had, uh, I've had uh, those pancakes. Which, I can't tell a lie. They're pretty good. And the thing about pancakes, they're an absolute doddle. Absolute doddle to make. I mean, at the end of the day, you could make it when you come out, but I could say more of it for a wee donner here uh, in the woods, so I just thought I'll make up before I go. But, I think that's it for the night. Like I say, been out, put a stove on, had a couple of pancakes, a few drink of juice, take the head up the road. So, just a wee short video, but let's like say back at the weekend. So, if you like this wee short video, give it a like, make sure to subscribe, and hit the bell for future notifications. And we'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching, folks. Adios, amigos.